What's going on guys? TBF Gaming, welcome back to a brand new episode of Ark Survival Evolved. We're jumping right back into things on the TBFG Patreon server on the Crystal Isles map with Archaic Ascension. A little bit of Gaia stuff going in here. So we're really excited to jump into things today. We actually found a couple little things we want to tame today. They're both passive tames. This guy wants plant species Z or X seed or aquatic mushrooms times six. That guy over there wants rare mushrooms. So we're going to try this. We're going to run back to base real quick. Also, we had to zoom in really close because check this armor out. We got like a little midriff going. I don't know. I consider myself kind of cool, but I don't think I can get away with that. All right, let's go back to the main base spot. In the last episode, we actually got ourselves a super amazing Dreadful Reaper. This guy was absolutely awesome. We had a fun running around with him and just eating things and wrecking face. Uh, it was a lot of fun. This guy's actually pretty good. He's up to level 909. We definitely got quite a few more levels that we can do on it, but we're going to let him heal up before we take him out for a while. There is a elixir that we can use to heal him up a little bit faster, but I just I don't have it yet. All right, let's see. Do I have any of the plant species seed? I think I can get some down in the swamp area. We're actually going to go down there right now. Uh, or Actually, let me see. Do I have? No. Plant. No. I thought maybe. I thought maybe we would. Okay, so plant species seed, no. Aquatic mushrooms would be the next thing. And then we need regular mushrooms for the other guy. So let's go let's just grab a whole stack of that. And then... Do we have our bird over here? Did I not bring my bird back? Oh, what were we doing? And we just lost our other bird. You still haven't healed up from your last excursion. Uh, but you're going to be the one we take out. Here we go. I think we can aim for the water. Here we go. Come on. Aim for the bushes on the left. We're not quite going to make it there. Okay, ready? Don't hit. Oh, that was way too soon. Oh, we didn't take damage. Nice. <laughs> that was super lucky. Okay. Now, I wanted to see. There's some crazy plants down here, so I was going to see if any of these. I don't think we get it from here, right? No, that's just regular stuff. There's, just, there's always weird plants in this game, so I'm always trying to go around and see what exactly they give you. I don't see anything crazy yet. That's crazy up there. What is that? A Savage Rex level 600. It's only 57,000 Torpor, but that is max level. Oh my god, guys. Do we stop what we're doing to go for that? Oh, oh, hold on. Nope. Not today, dude. Alright, we might come back for that. Savage Rex would be pretty cool. We've got a couple other things planned for today, but that would be a good fallback if we come back here. Alright. Still just looking for some seeds or anything that we can grab. Oh, here's a good metal spot. All right, let's 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 go back to last location because I don't want to lose the location. And then we're going to go around there see if there's any... Oh, no, no, no. Really? Did we make it out? Whoa, it teleported the raptor. What? What? Hold on. I don't know where he is. Hit him, hit him, hit him. Okay, hold on. Get your, get your arrows out, dude. Come on. Don't die. There we go. All right. There you go. He's down. Oh my god. It teleported us, but not... It didn't bring our guy. Okay. That was a disaster. Our frog's out there somewhere. Uh, unless it's dead. It had really low health. I didn't see a death message, but I don't know. Alright, let's put this down in the last one. I think it said a rare mushroom on this guy. Okay, 60%. Awesome. Okay, we'll give that just a minute. But this is a Heavenly Moss Chomps. I think this is the guy that has a special ability... But I'm not 100% sure. We just wanted to try it out just in case. All right, Bulb Dog, what else do you want? You'll take cooked lamb chop, cooked lamb chop or cooked prime meat as a backup or aquatic mushroom. All right, let's test this real quick. So we're going to go... I know we're not going to be able to find our frog for a little bit. That's fine. We'll go look for him in a little bit. Let's go back here. And right now our base is just called the fall-off place. We'll think of a base name as we start to actually build the base out. Hopefully in the next couple of days I'm going to start expanding the base and trying to make something out of it. What we're planning is I want to do a little bit of something from this island to that island. Because of S+, the way that it works in the INI, you can tell it to not require foundation. So you can come up with some really crazy builds. So that's what we have going on right there. All right, do you got some crazy stuff on you? Let's see. Just make sure it didn't have that. All right, meat. You've got the good stuff. We'll take that. Is it almost nighttime? I think it's almost nighttime. Alright. 
We'll put a bunch of this on here. That should cook up really fast. And then... I don't think this one can make up any of the plant species stuff, can it? Consumables, no. Kibble, no. Other. No, it can make mushrooms. It can make rare flowers. I don't see anything else that we could use. Creature mind wipe. Trophies. Okay, I think that's it. Let's grab another 100 arrows just in case. Alright. Should have... We got eight. We need a little over ten before we can go back. And then we'll get back over there. Oh, we need to eat ourselves. There we go. Alright. We got enough now. That should be enough. Let's wait for just a couple more. Consumable. Alright, let's go back and do this. Alright, fingers crossed. So the bulb dog is going to be a little bit slow tame because we don't have the right stuff for it. But I don't want to lose it. Uh, last location. Okay, let's check on the moss chomps first. Because we can give him this mushroom real quick. I don't know how long it's going to take for that second feeding. Put rare flower. Oh, you want something different. I don't know if I have rare flower. Hold on. Dang it. Hold on. Okay, I'll be right back. I have rare flower. I just got to go get it. All right, we got the rare flower. Let's do it. Put the, that away. Yeah, there we go. Heavenly moss chomps. Now, look at that. We are invisible. The only way that you're visible is if you pull the map out, right? No, no, I'm still not. Oh, yeah, there we are. Oh, we're riding inside of it. That's not a good way to ride it. Let's try this again. <laughs> there you go. And he's got super jumping abilities. I don't know if he's got any kind of attack. We're not going to... Actually, hold on. Let's find out right here. This guy's passed out. Perfect. Oh, he does a thousand. I've got a Moss Chomps. It's kind of a beast. Nice. I'm really excited about that. You... Let me pick you up before we do anything else. Because I just don't want to accidentally lose you. I know our inventory is a mess. We just got done dying again. All right, let's grab. Oh, you gather a lot of stuff. Should I check this area to see if there's some crazy seeds here? Nah, we're good. He wants this kind. All right, that's not going to be too bad. It'll take a minute, but we'll get ourselves a divine bulb dog, a divine moss chomps, and then yeah, that'd be that'd be pretty good. So. It's going to take them in between the next couple of feedings. So let me just go around this immediate area, eat some dodos. We're trying to get this guy leveled up. And I really wanted this episode to do our first evolution of an archaic dino. That'd be, I think it'd be a lot of fun. There we go. We got quite a few. There we go. Just 86 more kills to go. Let's do this. All right. Should be the last feeding on this guy. We've been just going around killing a little bit here and there. Come back, feed him. Yeah, there we go. Divine Bulb Dog. What is up, man? We got ourselves a shoulder pet. Let's go auto-activate. You just turn that little light on. That's what I'm talking about. Super excited about that. All right. We're going to continue to level up. So let me take a little while. This is going to take a, a minute because we're going around having to pick on a, a lot of the smaller creatures. Pretty much dillos and some raptors, but we got to be a little bit careful. Uh, because this is just a vanilla pteranodon, but we want to get him up to a beta pteranodon. We want to evolve him to the next one. So let me do that for a little while. I'll see you guys. In All right, guys. Almost there. We're sitting at... 92 kills. So we're so close, so close. We can definitely finish this off really quickly here. There we go. Got another one here. More melee. Yeah, we're sitting at just seven more kills. Seven more kills. We've been going around looking for dodos and dillos and anything small that we can take out, like this Pago Mastix. All Pagos must die. There we go. We probably could have spun attacking, but we need to get our stamina back up. Six more kills. Six more kills, then we're going to evolve this guy, like, immediately. We're not going to waste time leveling up any past that initial spot just because of uh, how long these guys take to level up or to get these many kills for something like this that doesn't kill real fast. It def definitely takes a while. There we go. All right, five more kills. Five more kills. Let's do this. Come on, come on, come on. Five more. The dodos are a little sparse. Oh, there we go. There we go. This is the spot here. This will be the spot. Oh, we got some lag. There we go. Or at least it felt like there was. I'm not sure. There's that guy. All right, three more, guys. Three more kills. Let's do this. There we go. One more kill. Come on. Yep. Come on. Let me catch you. Yes. Finally, that took so long. I can't believe how long it took to get 100 kills with the Pteranodon. You don't really keep track of it on a regular dino, so you don't really know 
how many you have or have not done. All right, wait as usual. Now, we were told get everything off that you don't want to lose, which honestly I don't really, other than I guess the arrows, I don't, I don't need hide. I've got tons of hide. So it's left control and X, and then you have to quickly get into the inventory, take the saddle, and bam, beta pteranodon. Where you at, man? Oh, man, look at this guy. Yeah, he looks amazing. 663, not a great level, uh, but we can put that on him. And then he's all bumblebee looking again. I'm going to have to give him a regular saddle because I don't like... Yeah, I'm not a fan of the bumblebee saddle now that we got an amazing looking pteranodon. All right, let's get us a quick kill real quick. See what the damage is like. 870. Way better. Definitely upgraded. Nice. That's, that's for like starting off. So we're going to be able to get quite a bit higher than that. That'll be awesome. Now I'm wondering, does the XP kind of start over in terms of leveling? Like, can we level really fast now? I don't know. Can we use a... There's Gaia Elixirs that we can use as we struggle through that. Oh, look at that. Green shark. Demonic shark. All right. Oh, somebody's got a base out here. Oh, I think that's... Is that Otto's? Oh, yeah. This is Otto's spot. I think. Yeah, I believe this was Otto's spot when he first first got going. Very cool. All right. He's got an amazing castle that we'll have to show you here in a few episodes. All right. So he's got five levels already so let's test this one more time all right so 313 standing like 313 just normal damage and then if we spin attack on like a dodo that was only 583 hmm all right we go all melee still 313 there's 1300 though that was a that was a pretty big upgrade how much damage are we doing just standing against one of these other guys um hold on let's try this yeah it says 313 did that one not go up for some reason i really don't know really strange all right yeah let me let me get back to base i want to kind of look up a couple things see how much time we've already recorded today and see if we got time to go get into some more trouble 468 that's a little better all right, so I don't think we have time to go out and really tame anything else. Plus, we already kind of have our target for the next couple days. I want to see how much this guy gathered, though. Oh, yeah, this guy's going to gather like crazy. And I kind of I already showed you, but he's got some super amazing hops like that. Look at that. <laughs> super amazing. Uh, C button is also like a little gather. What does that do? Gathers a little bit of everything. Control, no. C. How about right click? Uh, right click does like a little bite. Okay. He definitely gathers everything that we need. Very amazing. All right, so narco berries, no longer a problem. We can make all the Trank stuff with that. We need to, before the next episode, get into the Trank darts on the FMK station. So that's going to be the next step we get into. And then this guy, I do have one XP elixir left. Let's go the large XP elixir. Put this on. Th oh, I got two. Okay. So let's go ahead and consume that one. See if he gets a couple levels out of it. Uh, I don't know if it hasn't kicked in yet or if it didn't work on him. It may only work on the Gaia dinos. I don't honestly know. Okay. It definitely did not work. Okay, we'll keep an eye on it for just a second. If we suddenly get a whole bunch of levels, then we know why. All right, let's see what our damage is sitting at right now, though. Let's do some testing. We got to at least test it real quick just to see what our damage is. We haven't put too much levels in yet, so this is a good test. All right, so 1,300 without very many levels in, that's definitely not bad. This guy will be a pretty good beast once it's all said and done. Yeah, we definitely didn't get any levels for that XP elixir, so I don't know if they work on the Archaic Ascension Dinos. We'll have to find out. Oh, we got some lag going, though. All right, let's go melee. Also, you notice we can level speed up now, which is amazing. And his speed is already 150 without leveling it up at all. So we're pretty happy about that. But there you go, guys. Very amazing. Look at that, 1,800. I will take that. I will definitely take that. All right, so now we only have 391 kills to go for the next one. I, it's going to be several, several days. In fact, what we probably will do is I'm probably not going to use this guy to get up to alpha version. We'll keep this one at beta. This will be our beta bird. And then... Once we find a better Pteranodon, then we'll worry about getting that one to Beta and then to Alpha because th this one's just not very high low. And I don't remember what his base level was. 
Uh, but he definitely wasn't very high. So there you go, guys. Hope you enjoyed today's episode. I'm having a lot of fun with this series. This is I love playing Super Modded Arc. It's a lot of fun. I know a lot of people prefer vanilla, but it, I'm telling you, once you go to like crazy modded arc, it's hard to go back to something that's kind of like just 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 plain vanilla. The survivor survival stuff is a little bit heavier in a vanilla game, but I'm telling you, if you die so much in a series like this that it kind of balances out. But there you go, guys. Having a lot of fun. Really like my base place where we're going to be at. Uh, we're going to have to do all kinds of upgrades up here and have a really good time building up in this area. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. And if it's still there in the next episode, maybe we'll go for that. I think it's right down there-ish. There's that dreadful, or no, savage Rex that we can go after. I've never even tried one of those. That'd be kind of cool. All right, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you in the next episode of Ark Survival Evolved. Oh, whoa. Mess that one up. Try it again. Slow it down. The next episode of Ark Survival Evolved. Crystal Isles, Gaia, Archaic Ascension, having a great time on the TVFG Patreon server. See you guys in the next video. Oh, guys, we're not very smart. We just now realized that it says 400% or 400 seconds of XP up on the top right. So the XP elixir is not just like a give you XP. It's a uh, increased XP for a certain amount of time. We didn't read it. We didn't even check it. So now we know. Uh, let's go around and get some kills. And I'm going to keep doing that in between episodes. But I'll still see you in the next episode. I just want to bring you guys back. Let you know that I did catch it. It just took me a second.